I don't know. Oh. Am I a vegetarian? Am I a vegetarian? I don't know. What am I? Oh. I don't know. <laughs> don't have any time i'm not even gonna lie my little human is also up she for whatever reason she woke up early just like me um, so i'm gonna give her some snack and then i am gonna go work out because i have to be at work at eight i'm grateful to be able to work from home so it's not a rush like that so i'm just gonna work out for like a quick 20 minutes and i'm out okay I'm gonna take my vitamins. I'm currently taking some rituals. Yeah, I got myself some rituals. Um, this is like a week into it, so I don't really have much to say. Uh, but I feel good. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I just know that I'm okay. I'm okay. <laughs> but I got this for like gut health and you know multivitamins because this is particularly their multivitamins B12. So. I heard that this was really good for the girls, so I decided that I wanted to try um, when I was switching up my vitamins, and then I got that. And I feel amazing, I'm not even gonna lie. I feel great, I feel myself. Um, I don't feel bloated, that's one thing that I've heard the girls say. Mommy, bruh, bitch. closed from work it's currently almost two my schedule right now looks a lot more different okay because of this lady because of this little lady <laughs> so my schedule is changed um, but I've closed from work I'm about to cook some food I'm hungry I feel very down today I'm not even gonna lie I feel like I need to sleep <laughs> and it's snowing it's been snowing all day so Let's cook something and then I will just go and edit and relax for the rest of the day. I also have to do a run. We have to, I'm checking out a new daycare spot for Pramaka today. So I might go with you guys. Um, but for right now, I'm about to cook. So let's cook, okay? Time I think you're gonna walk out of my door I start to jump to the conclusion You don't love me no more Babe, give me something to work with Can you just reassure? basic but it's so good if you like sweet wine sweet white wine you would love this and it's just twelve dollars okay so it's that good oh, it's always so refreshing like always so refreshing and if you're wondering um, the alcohol percentage in here it's five percent five point five so Question what my future has in store. I get to panicking anxiety, can't live here no more. No more, no more, no, no more, no more. I'll convince myself that I don't want what I really need. 
topped it up with some cheese as you guys could see uh, I know that this pasta is not the regular pasta so I'm dreading myself for using it because again hmm, actually not bad <laughs> the season is perfect the season is perfect the pasta is obviously different from your regular regular pasta because again it's wheat pasta so it doesn't give you that you know starchy thing that pasta would give you on a regular but it's nice this is actually good <laughs> i'm gonna go sit down and enjoy this i'm watching something on netflix right now called war it's a nigerian series it's a political series it's really nice by um mo abudu mo abudu she's a big 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 producer out in nigeria so her movies are always like top notch so i like to watch that um so i'm watching it right now i'm gonna keep watching that and just have my dinner and then when we're done we're gonna go to the daycare because i have to go so yeah. oh my god you guys <laughs> i am so sorry i didn't take you to the daycare we literally just came back from the daycare <laughs> literally just came back from the daycare i have papers and everything but it was a good trip the daycare is so beautiful the lady is so nice <sighs> let me just breathe for a second because it's so cold and so slippery outside and the frappa was almost about to fall down <laughs> it was so funny but we all went we went together as a family and we're back home so okay guys so I have a few things that was just delivered by Amazon, so let's go ahead and unbox that. The box has been sitting in the rain for a little bit. Okay. So this, my husband got this, so I'm just going to put it to the side. What is that? <laughs> this is some boob um, nipple covers. I will show you guys. Give me one second. Let me... This is some nipple covers. I think you guys are not positioned well. Let me show you what's... I had one. Um, I had an older one that I... I don't know. I think I mistakenly put, put it in the, the laundry machine. And it's messed up. <laughs> so I have to get another one. Um, but this is a different style. So I'm actually excited for this one. Because I've lost weight. My boots are all gone. I'm not even gonna lie. Like the boots, they're all gone. <laughs> they're all gone. Cause I lost weight, so that's just a reality. So let me I got this particular one in a different style. And I like the package that it comes in. I really like that. This is so extra. Just like me. <laughs> like it's as extra as I like my packaging. They kind of look big, I'm not gonna lie, but let's let's go in and see what we have. What is this? Is it just nipple covers? Okay, so this is what they look like. And you're just gonna like, you know, put this underneath then push it up i like this because this will mimic an actual bra you know so i prefer this the other one that i had was like this which also kind of looks like a bra but i prefer like the push and pull up as compared to like you know the hold down if it makes sense 
yeah so this is what it looks like i will leave a link for you guys all these stuff are always linked on my amazon so um, if you're wearing sorry mama sorry <coughs> go for it go for it anyway and this is in a size l large i should have gotten size medium like why would i get so large um but just so you know it's cute it's comfortable i like this this bra because you know when you're wearing some outfits that you don't want the bra to be showing or you don't want to have the bra straps out and whatnot this is always perfect if you're wearing a backless dress this is perfect so yeah let's put you to the side to the side i like short nails <laughs> You don't have boyfriend? <laughs> have you guys seen the video? Don't have boyfriend? You say, you like them longer shot. And they say, I like short nails. And then the lady is like, that's why you don't have boyfriend. Because <laughs> you have short nails? That's why you don't have boyfriend. <laughs> I should find a video and play for you guys because it's so funny. Um, but I have some swimsuits. I do have a trip that is coming up this year. Okay, so I'm excited for that. Um, but I started shopping for the trip. That's just what it is. I have some swim suit. I will show you this when it's time to actually travel. Uh, that's some swimwear. And oh yeah, this one I'm excited about because this is a one. Um, this is a jumpsuit. Okay, it's a one-piece jumpsuit. Um, but it has a cut in the back. Oh, I can't wait to put it on. Look, 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 look. Do you guys see the back? Like this is literally the back and then it has the scrunch, a scrunch in the bum. So it's gonna like hold your butt and then give you something in the back. Ooh. Mommy, budget, budget. So this is what it looks like. It comes with some pads for the boob area. I think I'll actually wear this tomorrow because why the fuck not? <laughs> like why shouldn't I wear it? Um, the back is like it's giving sexy. I will wear it tomorrow in the morning, right? Then when my husband comes downstairs, I'm just gonna turn around and be like that. <laughs> Literally, I'm just gonna do that. So you should look at my back, okay? Um, but this is really beautiful. I really like it. I'll put a photo of the model on the screen so that you guys see what it looks like. Because I'm not trying it on for you to see right now. Um, but yeah, it's cute. It's. I think this would be such a nice like throw on and go. Put some jacket over it. Put on some shoes. And this will be perfect for running errands, so that's why I got that. And I also have a few more things. Let's see. What is this? What the hell is that? I don't know. Like I'm always ordering these things, and I don't even know what it is. Uh, oh, this is a dress. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is a black dress. It's a simple black dress. Um. It's actually very simple than I thought. Very, very simple. But I intend to style this. So I'm going to style it on my Instagram. Um, and then I also intend to take it to the trip that I'm going on too. So you guys will see. If I do take it, it's very basic. So I don't know if I will take it on that trip. Um, it's just a regular double black dress. Then it comes with some ruching on the sides, around the boobs area. Um, but that's about it okay and the last two things I'm gonna bring you guys down so that we see them for the last two things I have a taco holder let me show you oh, let's talk about it <laughs> so this is a taco holder rack because okay. whenever you make tacos, they never stand, and I hate that. <laughs> I just hate it. So I got, I got this situation to make tacos. Okay. <laughs> so this is basically the taco holder. Um, it comes with some stems that you can use to partition them so that you know when you put the taco it's like placed nicely let me see if they put a photo of him such a bad depiction they didn't put nothing oh but this is so cute they put
put some stickers. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, that's so cute. That is so cute. Look, they put some stickers. Um, Mr. Taco. Oh, this is so cute. I like that. <laughs> I really do. Let me bring you guys closer so that you see what I'm doing. You just arrange them like so. Oh, okay, that was some work. And then this is the little container. <laughs> I don't know the name, but this is like a serviette that it comes with. But this is where you put your dip and stuff into. So it just sits here. And you have your taco rack. Mm -hmm. So this is a taco rack. I love it. <laughs> like it make my it will make my work so simple when it comes to taco. And in, in the center it says let's talk about it, which is let's tackle about it. <laughs> so I like that. It comes with some stickers. So I'm just gonna put the stickers on top of it. Ooh, ooh. I don't know why I'm doing that. I'm sorry. They know me, that's why they added the stickers. I'm going to use the stickers like it is me, it is I, and I like stickers. <laughs> oh, this is cute. Taco time! Let's do taco time. I should have done taco time. Let's do taco time here. It's giving Mexico! Okay. We like it, we like it, we like it. It's giving. <laughs> And then I put this one over here. I feel like this one matches here. And then the rest in the back. And then it comes with two spoons as well. Um, this is not necessarily spoons, but like, you know. You can use it to do that, okay? So that's that for Mr. Taco situation. Like that. Impressed, love it. And then I have one last thing. I do have one last thing. This is a pot organizer that I got. So, ouch. <clears throat> this is a photo of what it looks like. So I'll just use it to arrange my pots under my, you know, underneath the shelves. Uh, but honestly, don't think I want to do this right now. If I'm being completely honest, I don't think I want to build anything, construct anything. Like, I, I'm, I, I can't. <laughs> I am out of sorts, so I can't do it right now. But this is what it looks like. It looks like we have to put it together. I will do that another day, tomorrow. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> like, not today, girl. Not today. But that is pretty much everything that we have. So that is pretty much everything that I have for today. I'm not gonna lie. If you guys don't see me again for the rest of the day, it means that it's good night. <laughs> it's 5.45, I'm gonna get into editing. I have to edit a new video for you guys. Um, that's just my life, edit. And then later at about like eight-ish, I will shower, shower from a pot and then just call it a night. But I'm done with you for today. Daycare one was good, work was good, everything is good. I I will see you guys, I guess, tomorrow, okay? I will see you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, happy Friday. I do look very crusty. <laughs> I look like somebody's little homeless child. But one thing I've never shy to do is come on here looking like myself. <laughs> I always say that in my defense. Anyway, happy Friday. Um, I literally just closed from work and this is me at work today. This is my outfit and this is my hair. I took out my hair from Conrose because I have to um, do some sort of hair treatment. I am dedicated to taking care of my hair this year so that's what I'm going to do. So today is just um, Friday. I'm going to be cleaning around the house. I've, de I've decided to do that just so that I can relax on Saturdays because I would clean on Saturdays but now because I get out of work early, um, it's currently 3, my schedule changed, I told you guys, so um, it's good because I can clean around the house and do stuff. 
Um, so we'll just do that. We'll do some hair masks today. I'm thinking of doing an avocado type of hair mask. And I really do want to get a sewing done. I'm not going to lie. And if it's not a sewing, I want to get tapings done. But I, it's not in my budget right now. <laughs> it's not in a girl's budget. Okay. So I have to live with my wigs. But not. I'm tired of the wigs. I am tired of the wigs. I keep saying it. I'm trying to look for a way that I don't have to wear my wigs. And I'm thinking maybe a sewing would be the option. Because my hair right now is, you know, kind of, sort of free it's not so natural <laughs> you know and that's okay with me i'm fine i'm just trying to get healthy hair so that's the thing um but i will figure out what i want to do i might do that or me and my sister my big sister we're talking right now i mean texting and we're both thinking of getting a upat wig um so we'll decide and then we'll probably do that yeah she has a reply so we'll decide and probably do that together and see how it goes we'll both try together and see how it goes um but happy friday happy weekend okay i will show you guys the frame yes we we're putting up the frames and the thing the thingy magic the shit um uh, the machine that we used to you know screw is dead i don't know why i can't find the words but the battery was dead so we had to put it on charge um so i will show you guys how the frames are looking um but yeah enough of the talking <laughs> enough of the talking let me just do what i have to do so that time doesn't go by me hi why are your shoes ma guys can you imagine so before prior to um the day let me not say to the day. <laughs> so before we had watched the Netflix um, documentary that I told you guys about, about food, right? Before we watched that, I put in an order for a box of HelloFresh for a week because I was like, um, you know, I feel like it's going to save me time. And HelloFresh does save you time, not going to lie, you know, because all the meals are already curated. You have your ingredients put together and everything. It's so helpful. But... I didn't <laughs> but I didn't order um, a vegetarian meal through HelloFresh I went with chicken so I have you know like some chicken still sitting out here I actually defrosted some because I'm like oh, maybe let's eat let's just finish the HelloFresh and then you know I'll be done with chicken but I'm not gonna lie and when I say endomico I'm not even craving this like me of all people telling myself that i'm gonna throw the chicken away and i'm literally throwing it away and i'm thinking to myself could that be it could that be the sign that i need to tell me that i'm done eating this because i told you guys i haven't eaten chicken i haven't eaten pork literally nothing i had eggs for sure because i told you that i don't think i can stop eating eggs i'm still eating cheese so i'm not a vegetarian i'm not like a full vegetarian i don't know what i am but i just know that i don't want to eat that oh, but it's so weird because i'm literally putting it in the trash okay like let me show you she is going right into my trash i am it's crazy like i put a whole chicken in the trash I threw the chicken away, you guys. It's gone. It's in the trash. So, and once it's in the trash, it's gone. It's gone for good. So, ah, you guys. I don't know. Am I a vegetarian? Am I a vegetarian? I don't know. What am I? I don't know. Chicken is in the trash. It's in the trash. It's in the trash. Yay, 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 yay. Oh, yay. I've had fish. Over the past few days, I'm adding tofu into my meals. Like, the girl is changing the diet. And I'm happy about that. I'm, ha I'm happy, ma. I'm happy because I'm making healthy decisions for myself, which is going to come down to you and your sister. And I'm so happy about that. Okay? So, oh, she's not eating chicken again or whatever. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if that's an achievement, but yeah. I'm done. I'm done.
Okay, you guys, so it's time for me to do my hair mask. Um, I just sort of like partially washed my hair. You guys have seen my hair so many times. <laughs> I feel like whenever I take out my hair, I'm like, oh, it might come as a surprise to them, but it's not a surprise, is it? Because my hair is just my hair. <laughs> Anyway, you guys, so I have my hair mask um, here. I have avocado and mayonnaise in this one. I'm just going to throw in some oil. Um, and, yeah. This is just going to be... So this is some rosemary and hint oil. Did I say hint? Rosemary and mint. The hell? What the hell is hint oil? Anyway. I wanted to talk to you guys about something because it's so crazy to me if I don't talk to you about it, right? So me and my husband were just watching, um, we're watching this series on Netflix called The Trust. It's a reality TV show. So if you're into reality TV shows, you probably would really like it too. Um, but it's called The Trust on Netflix and it's just basically, it's like a game, reality TV game where there's a money situation i don't want to spoil it for anyone that hasn't watched it but if you're into stuff like um you know just reality tv shows that are fun that will leave you in suspense all of that good stuff then you should watch it okay because it's really nice it's really really nice and you know it's just all about um building trust and you know a household of people again i don't want to spoil it but if you've watched it if you haven't watched it, skip. Let me just say that. If you haven't watched it, skip all the way ahead because you don't need to listen to this conversation. But if you watched it, this part is for you. Because, right? I have an issue with Winnie and Tolu and the way they carried themselves in this particular game. Because tell me why you're the only two black girls in the game. And I feel like they didn't represent black people as well as they should. Why do I feel like Winnie and Tolu were just moving very diabolical in this game? If you've watched it, comment below and don't let me feel like my husband and I were feeling the same way or we're just, you know, it was just too much because for us, what Winnie and Tolu was doing right in the beginning, you guys were moving funny, took out a guy that had no business going out, had no business with you. He wasn't even hating you. Oh my god. Like when I say I want to go on and on about this game. It has really annoyed me. So if you haven't watched it. You should probably skip ahead. <laughs> because it made me so mad. Because Winnie and Tolu being the only two black girls in this game. Mind you. This is a game where we have like a mixture of people. And the only colored people. Black girls in the household just didn't have a good reputation and that's my opinion because they were supposed to be like you know like it just really showed they showed themselves out in a way that was just no i wasn't i wasn't for it at all i'm like what are you girls doing nobody even hates you here is tolu talking about um i'm an immigrant and my parents suffered from nigeria and what 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 bitch nobody cares about that <laughs> Ain't nobody cares about that. If you feel like you're, you're too sad and the world is too... Don't come on Netflix and come and be bringing your sad so piece out there. No. That's just my opinion. You know, like, no. It's a game. Everybody's out there for a game. So don't come and be standing there with your, like, sad story. I'm very, like... I really had a problem with them moving like that. It's like, no. And here's Winnie trying to be, like, the boss of everyone. And trying to get everyone on her side and trying to make it look like if you're not on her side you're on a bad team no ma'am like oh my god i had an issue i had a big issue watching that thing i can't wait to watch the last episode on the 24th i can't wait to see when he's out just so you know <laughs> i don't mean to spoil it but i'm that girl that will spoil it for you so don't come here if you're if you don't want anything to be spoiled don't come here but i'm also that girl that will give you like good netflix recommendations because you know i watch good stuff <laughs> i have an eye for good stuff i can just say that so if you haven't watched The Trust, you should probably watch it. But I hope that I haven't spelled it enough for anybody. But I really don't care because I told you that if you don't want it to be spelled, skip. 
Um, but I'm not really happy with the way the black girls, you know, the only two black girls in this game. I'm not happy with the way they carried themselves because I feel like they could have done a lot more better than what they did. Um, but either way, a game is a game. However you play, however you play, I don't mind. Like however you play, I respect it. I really don't care. Mommy, no, not not the photo frame. God. <laughs> however you play, I don't care. But I just had an issue with the fact that you know the only two black girls in the game, they weren't carrying themselves well. I mean, not like they carrying themselves well, like they didn't respect themselves or anything. They were just a little too diabolic for me. Like, I'm like, if I'm in this house, I'm not becoming friends with you girls because what is this? Like, no, I didn't like it at all. Um, but it's generally like a really good thing. It will keep you hooked to your seat. So I'm sure a lot of you are watching. If you haven't, you had it here first. The trust is really good. So this is the hair max. Um... Why did I just say max? <laughs> um, but this is a hair mask. It's in my hair. I'm gonna just go sit for a little. This is the nature of my hair right now. It's kind of relaxed. <laughs> kind of relaxed. I'm not gonna lie. I texturized my hair over the, Chris <laughs> over the Christmas season. I didn't really tell you guys. Okay. But I did. But it was just like a little bit of texturizer. Nothing serious. Um. So... That's why my hair kind of looks really relaxed right now because I was, I'm like, you know what, I don't care. <laughs> I'm just going to texturize my hair. But after I'm like, uh, no. <laughs> I'm always doing the most with my hair. Um, but I'm just going to sit it out for a little. I'm going to go sit in my heat cup situation. Um, there's a new thing on Netflix. It's the weekend, so I'm just going to watch something else. If you guys don't see me again, just see that. Just know that you see me tomorrow. Let me wash my hands because, wow. <laughs> That's bad. That's bad for business. Careful, name pra. Careful, name pra. Sifo. Sifo, pra free. Hey! Chese, in Colombo, I'm going to say they won't. Who can say Sifo? No, Jinaso. Like, she's literally still there. Not even listening to me. Like, I exist. Eh? Can you imagine? Anyway. <laughs> Having kids will teach you nothing but patience. Because if you are not patient, <laughs> you are not patient as a parent, and I don't know what you're doing. <laughs> anyway, I'm just going to go sit this out. Um, you guys have seen my heat cap. I think I might have got the avocado all of myself, but it's late anyway, and I'm going to shower after this, so it's okay. Um, but again, if you don't see me again today, that means that I'm gonna see you tomorrow, okay? Saturday. Tomorrow is Saturday, so. If I don't see you again, good night. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> good night. Uh, 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 uh. Mm, 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 mm. Good morning. Good morning, guys. Happy Saturday. It is currently 10 28. Oh. We have a black on black today. I just finished taking my shower. Frog Pie is still sleeping, so that's why I'm talking like that. But I'm about to make breakfast and basically do the Saturday. Saturday is for tidying up the house. I said yesterday I wanted to tidy up the house. I didn't do that. I'm not gonna lie. So I'm gonna do that today. So let's go. the end of the weekend but i still wanna turn up yeah i still wanna turn up all i want is to go again but you ain't picking your phone up why you messing my head up any night any day let me take you away all i need is just saying yeah 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 better nights better days when you're here with me, babe Cause you're all that I crave So I wonder Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Don't hide away from me When I need you most We got love guaranteed And I have to know Say Just pick up your phone, tell me where you'll be Cause 
Cause I gotta know Let me know when you're ready Cause I made reservations Too many invitations And the last night was heavy, heavy. I need communication Tell me where's your location Used to talk 24-7 Every other second Just to make sure we were up to date Now it's closer to 11 And I ain't hearing nothing I just need to know that you're okay later it's currently time for me to do my hair I said to myself that if I um, did everything that I had to do on my to-do list which includes cleaning the house um, working on some paper stuff that I had to do and everything I was gonna do my hair so now it's time to do my hair I ate dinner everything is done I'm about to you guys I'm about to install some tapings for myself can you imagine like should I should I not do it tell me what should I do should I should I should I not <laughs> like I don't know I don't know how I feel should I do it or not I don't know um but I have my setup all done I think I am gonna go ahead to do it so yeah Let's install some tapings. I already blow dried my hair. I straightened the hair. So this is what my hair looks like right now. Hmm. So I'm just gonna... <laughs> I've been watching a lot of videos on YouTube. I told... I don't know if I... I think I've told you guys that I have taping extensions that I was supposed to install. But I wanted to get them professionally done. But then also I'm like, you know what, maybe do them by myself. So I think I'm just going to do them by myself. So I will just do them. Um, I mean, I'll just do my hair and show you guys what it looks like when I'm done. If it goes bad, you guys will see. If it goes well, you will see as well. But yeah, I am about to install some tapings. Ah, I don't know. Let's see. Okay. Okay. So I put the first one in. And how do I feel? I don't know. But it's there. I mean, I know that I've done it well because, again, I've watched a few videos, so... I do know exactly how you're supposed to layer it. Okay, so I will show you guys what I've done because, yeah, I need to concentrate, so. Hey guys. <laughs> I did it, literally. Like, I did it, you guys. Isn't it crazy? that this is just my first time doing tapings and i feel like i might have you know i have i have a hang of it um i'm not gonna lie i ran out of hair i didn't do my calculations well because i ran out of hair i mean i didn't run out of hair per se but i ran out of the type of hair that i was using in the back the type of hair that i started with um i started working with i had run out of that so i had to put 
some kinky pieces in the front but it's not so bad right because i feel like you know the front the kinky pieces in the front will match my hair um a lot more since my hair in the front is what people would see a lot more but this is what it looks like right now i'm about to cut it up i just want to say that the quality for this hair is like really good okay it's like very nice and you know for a first timer i'm very happy <laughs> I'm happy, I'm happy with how it looks. I'm impressed, you know. It's given your own hair but volume. So it's very it's very weird, like it's a weird feeling. It's like it's like it's my hair, right? Like it's literally my hair. Like it feels amazing. Um I think I did amazing, if you ask me honestly. I think I did a good, good, good job. Thank you guys. I know you can still like the back the back might not be entirely perfect um, but from the people's videos that I've watched even their videos their back wasn't perfect so <laughs> you know so now I have to like um, I wanted to show it to you guys before I cut it I look you don't want to cut it but I have to cut it um, I'm not gonna lie I don't want to cut it now that I think about it but because of the pieces that I use because the kinky you know it's a different length and i want to shape it up i don't want to like just leave it blunt so i'm gonna do that but also again i wanted to show it to you guys before you know before i styled and did the cutting and everything so i'm tired it's past 10 i'm ashamed okay <gasps> it's actually 11 <gasps> it's 11 I have to give it from a pair bath. I'm ashamed. I have to give it a bath. So I will see you guys later. Okay. Hey guys. Hey guys. So I am just coming on here to end off this week's vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. I didn't keep the tape ins in. Obviously, as you can see, that's because I didn't have enough hair. I woke up in the morning and I realized that the hair was uneven. So the black hair, I mixed two different types of tapings and I didn't like the color that it was given. So what I'm going to do is order a new set and actually get it professionally done. Yeah. <laughs> um, but we'll talk a lot more about that in the next vlog or in next week's vlog. So I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Okay. When they say she get it from her mama Mama say you fuck her right Your body blue is fun for life Tell me in the home But come tell me is you down Cause I'm trying to go good tonight I only hope you slept her right I just wanna live in a fantasy I think we deserve